Hi, I'm Danielle Wilson from MostlySewing.com and I haven't made a video on Facebook yet so I thought I'd start today with this large box of fabric that I got recently. Uh, I've been going a little crazy getting ready for fall and I'm really excited to show you what I got in here. It's not all from Fabric.com, this was just a big enough box. Um, so to start with, I got this red flannel. I have the receipt over here so I re remember what everything is. This red flannel, um, this is one of the mammoth flannels, plaid. I think I'm going to make a flannel scarf out of this. It's not as soft as some other flannels, but I think it'll look cute for a scarf. My coat's black and white, so I didn't want to do gray for that like I normally do. <laughs> Everything's gray. Um, next, I have this flannel too. This is a white frame. It's called um, Robert Kaufman Framework in grid work. Let's see. Framework. And I love it because it has this black line and then has a little spotted for gray. I'm going to make a blouse out of this and it's going to be really cozy because it's flannel for the winter. Um, then I have this, which is a charcoal. It's a French terry. I'm going to make some kind of cardigan sweatshirt type thing out of it. It is a bamboo rayon French terry. I'm going to put all the links in the blog post. So just go to the blog post. It'll be in the caption there and you'll be able to see what I got um, and where I bought it. This one is just a gray jersey knit. It's just polyester. I think I'm just making a comfy t-shirt out of it to try a new pattern. It wasn't too expensive. Oh, it was only like six bucks a yard. So yeah, I'm just it's just good practice for making it trying out a new pattern. Then I got some stuff that I'm super excited about, which are these cotton and steel charm packs in the rifle paper co print i bought four of them because i hate cutting fabric um i got them from fat quarter shop i'm going to make half square triangles out of this print and just cut these in half and make those triangles out of it i'm going to make about a queen size quilt so that i can keep it on a bed around my house all the time and then i have this fat quarter pack that i got from fabric bub um, it's beautiful. I'm also going to use this in the half square triangle quilt. And then I have about five yards of the Robert Kaufman Essex linen in natural. I'm going to do one half in the uh, cotton, and, cotton and steel print, the rifle paper coat print, and then the other half of the triangle will be the solid. Um, I think it'll be nice. It has a really cool texture. Um, they'll balance each other out. And then I bought a random charm pack in fall colors because as you know, tomorrow is the first day of fall and I want to make a maple leaf table runner out of the half square triangle and square print. So I'm going to start with these and cut them down. It's a lot of maroon in here, some red and then some orange. And I'll probably have some of that linen left over. So I think I'm gonna use some of the linen with this to make a table runner be all solids. And I think it'll look really cute. Um, so that's it. Bought a lot of stuff. Very excited. Um, all the, like I said, all the links will be in my blog post. So um, you might be seeing this on my blog or if you clicked on it in YouTube, I'll have a link to the blog post right in the caption of the of the YouTube video so that you can find it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my first YouTube video. <laughs> I'm going to go try and edit this now and see how it turns out. Thanks for stopping by.